officially wearing my first Christmas shirt. Hey guys, welcome back to another video. If you're new, welcome to my channel. My name is Zoe and today is the first day of Zoomus. I finished my 20 page primatology paper about an hour ago. I'm officially free from college. As you can see, I'm back home, so please ignore the mess. I'm currently unpacking and reorganizing my whole entire bedroom because I have everything from college here and all of my animals. I'm trying to figure out where everything's gonna go. But I really wanted to film something and get Zoomus underway since it's already been a week of December. So please just ignore the mess for now. So for today's video, I'm gonna be talking about gifts for reptile lovers. So if you're shopping for somebody for Christmas, and they have reptiles, they keep herbs, they love reptiles. I'm just gonna be giving you guys some good gift ideas. Some of them are just gonna be general gift ideas. Others may require you to actually know a little bit about what kind of animals they might have and the care that they might require. So there's gonna be quite, kind of a wide range of present ideas. And if you're a reptile keeper, maybe you can put some of these on your Christmas wish list. It'll help you maybe make that list for Santa. So I'm just gonna start off with the very basic ones everybody thinks of, money. You know, we gotta feed our animals, we gotta buy feeders, we might have to buy greens and fruits and veggies, you gotta pay for electricity cause all the lights and the heat and <sighs> So they cost money. So just money, money is a great gift. Kind of going off of this are gift cards. So for example, I asked for gift cards for Christmas. I asked for just Walmart and Price Chopper. That's where I would be buying Arcadius's food. So I just said, you know, if you wanna give me gift cards, here's the grocery stores where I shop for Arcadius. This would be helpful. So, you know, if you don't wanna just hand over money, you wanna feel like you're actually giving a gift, gift cards are great. I mean, maybe, you know, where they're getting their feeders from. If they're getting them from PetSmart, Petco, Pet Supplies Plus, um, online sites like Josh's frogs or rainbow mealworms. Um, gift cards to these sites, they're great, they're versatile, they can use whatever they need them for. And it's not just handing over money, it's actually kind of like a little gift. So now that we've got those basics out of the way, we're gonna move into some actual physical gifts that aren't just versatile money gifts. So the next gift I'm gonna talk about is something every reptile keeper should have. So the person you're shopping for might already have it. If they don't though, it's an excellent gift. And that is a temperature gun. A lot of people use these now. They're much more accurate than the little thermometers you stick in your enclosures. You point at the spot that you wanna check the temperature for, you hit the little button and a little laser shoots out and then the screen tells you what the temperature is. So these are brilliant. This one I have is the Newbie. I got it off of Amazon. There are a ton on Amazon with Amazon Prime. So I will be sure to put a link for this in the description below if you wanna go check them out and buy one. I will be putting everything I talk about. If there's an Amazon link for it, I'll be putting a link in the description. And they will be an affiliate link. So if you do click on them and buy through the link, I'll get a little bit of that back. Every little bit helps. All the money I make goes right back to my animals. Reptisafe water conditioner, you can never have enough. Maybe you're looking for a stocking stuffer. It's great in a stocking. The next gift requires you to know a little bit about the reptile keeper and the animals that you are shopping for. This one is for omnivorous or herbivorous reptiles. And that is the Rubbermaid Fresh Vent Tupperware containers. These are great, they keep your fresh produce fresh. I use these for Arcadius and I love them. They keep my greens and my fruits and my veggies fresh so much longer. I'm not wasting as much anymore. I wish I had these in every size, to be honest. These are amazing. You can never have enough. I highly recommend. If you know, if your friend has an iguana, a Euromastix, a bearded dragon, any of those reptiles that eat fruits or veggies, these are a great, great gift. Kind of going off of that, if you know that the person you're shopping for has to cut up vegetables a lot, like squash into little tiny pieces for their animals, I highly recommend some sort of spaghetti squash maker or something like that. 
so it makes it so much easier. I got one for Christmas last year. I asked for one. I wish I knew where it was right now. It's packed up so I can't show you guys, but I'm going to be putting a picture right here as well as a link for Amazon in the description below. But it's like a dual sided one. Each side has different sizes of spaghetti and you just stick the squash in and twist and it makes spaghetti squash. And oh my gosh, it has saved me so much time and so much headache when cutting up squash for Arcadius. It is great. All right, moving on. So now we're into a little less of uh, reptile supplies, but still reptile related. And the first thing for that that I'm gonna mention are t-shirts, sweatshirts, any kind of clothing. So for example, I have this t-shirt from Ontario Iguanas. It says, I promise no more reptiles. And on the back, it has the fingers crossed. And it says Ontario Iguanas down there. So, if you don't know who Robin is, go follow her on Instagram. She has a bunch of iguanas. They're super, super cute. Her Instagram is called Ontario Iguanas. And she has lots of shirts and fun stuff like this. Great for reptile keepers. But this just happens to be one of the things that I have from her that I really recommend. Everybody gets a kick out of this shirt. Every time I wear it, people think it's hilarious. It's great. And it really applies to my life because every time I say, okay, no more reptiles, I end up getting another reptile. I'll put the link for that in the description below. Also, if you just search on Amazon or even Redbubble, there are tons of just even Christmas related t-shirts, sweatshirts, but even not Christmas related. I mean, you go on Redbubble, any design there is pretty much beyond like a t-shirt or sweatshirt or something. I actually just ordered a Christmas iguana sweatshirt from Amazon. I'm waiting for it to come in. But this is it right here. So I'll put the link for that in the description below. Maybe you're shopping for someone that keeps iguanas and loves Christmas like me. I am obsessed. It's a great, great gift. And speaking of Redbubble, if you haven't checked out my Redbubble, you should go check it out. I did just put up this new design. It is a reptile Christmas design. It says Merry Herpmas. It's got all the reptiles I could possibly think of. I asked you guys on Instagram what your favorite herps were so I could make sure to include them. There's Pac-Man frogs, just frogs in general, axolotls, Komodo dragons, crocodiles, sea turtles, tortoises, iguanas, chameleons, different kinds of chameleons, snakes, different, well, different kinds of snakes. Everything I could think of is in that Christmas tree. I will be making another one that says Mary Zoomus because like I said, this is Zoomus. You guys voted for Zoomus. I asked Herpmas or Zoomus, Zoomus won. But I still want to make the design for Herpmas. So go ahead and go check out my red bubble. That will be in there. And for the month of December, I am donating 25% of the profits made from, from red bubble and my calendars to the International Iguana Foundation. If you didn't see that video, go check it out. I talk all about it there. So which kind of leads into my next gift, which are my Arcadius calendars. We as reptile keepers, especially people that have a lot, kind of like to use calendars or planners so you can like plan out. I mean, you gotta track like when your snakes are eating, when others eat. A lot of our reptiles don't eat every day. So calendars are a great gift for reptile keepers, especially when they're reptile related. So I have my Arcadius calendars here. I'll put the link for that in the description below. And again, 25% of the profits made from that are going back to the International Iguana Foundation for Christmas. So we would really, really, really appreciate it if you guys shop from our Redbubble or our calendars this month and helped us donate back to them because we really want to be able to give them a great Christmas and help those wild iguanas. So it'd be much appreciated. Okay, so now I'll stop promoting all of my stuff and go back to the list of Christmas presents. So next up are accessories. If you're shopping for a reptile keeper that likes jewelry, there's a ton of jewelry out there. If you look on Etsy, on Amazon, there's a necklace that I want that's shaped like an iguana and has a little heart in it. So there's tons of stuff like that. There's snake necklaces, bearded dragon necklaces. There's probably some earrings, definitely earrings, earrings um bracelets also with accessories are phone cases and even better personalized phone cases so i didn't show you guys this but i did order this case for myself in october from arm the animals so they have a lot of personalized items you just submit a picture of your pet they cut out the head and they put it on the item so this was one of the halloween things they had it was a candy cane phone case 
and I sent in Arcadius's head and they put it on here. They do have a lot of Christmas stuff now or just unholiday related items, you know, phone cases, mugs, even t-shirts. So definitely go check them out. It's Arm the Animals. Their website will be in the description. All you need is a picture of the Reptile Keeper's pet and they will be able to do magic. All right, and then going on to home accessories, home goods. There are a ton of things that you can find. You know, you go to the store, anything with a snake or a lizard, pretty good. I actually got these at the Akron Zoo, but they're just a good example. They are coasters. They are watercolor chameleons. You guys probably saw these in my zoo gift shop haul video after my ginormous zoo trip that I took. So these are just great little house gifts for a reptile keeper. They're super cute. I don't have a chameleon, but I love chameleons and I love art. So they're great. Here's another example. This is a little lizard that my dad got for me. He found it and it was blue and had a really long tail. So it made him think of Arcadius. So he got that for me. It sits on my shelf. I love it. It's so cute. Now maybe you're shopping for a child, a significant other, someone that you're willing to spend a lot of money on. If you know that they're doing some tank upgrades maybe, or that, you know, maybe there's a tank that they want, those Exoterra front opening tanks, anything fancy like that, custom build tanks, you want to dump money into that and get them something extremely special like that, by all means. If you guys follow me on social media, you know that I actually got a shelving unit for all of my tanks, which I will show you after I'm all done moving in and getting everything organized. But my next project is going to be saving up to upgrade some tanks. I would really like to have front opening tanks so I can make better use of the shelves and not have to leave all this empty space for lamps and to be able to open up the tanks and get into them. So if you want to spend some money on whoever it is you're shopping for, tanks are great as long as you know exactly what it is that they're looking for, the size that they need. So again, that kind of requires you to know a little bit about the person and the animals that you are shopping for. There's some really awesome mugs out there. I have an iguana mug, I love it. You can get Real Creative and Personal, again, Redbubble, Etsy, they're everywhere. A subscription to Reptile Magazine. There's always lots of great information and articles in here. I used to have one and I loved it. And your gifts don't necessarily have to be reptile related, they could just be pet related. So I have this sign, I got it because of Arcadius, he was all I really had at the time. I love it. I got it from Icing a couple years ago, and it says, my pet is cuter than your boyfriend. This would be a great gift. I am obsessed with this. The one thing I really, really don't recommend as a gift is an actual reptile or amphibian itself. Unless the person you're shopping for, like, is planning on getting it, is looking for one, like actively looking for one and planning on getting one, then I guess it's okay. But still better to do that with the person. Like if you really wanna buy them one, just be like, hey, I know you're looking for it. I wanna buy it for you, so let's do it together. Because a lot of the time, you wanna make a connection with the animal that you're buying. So you can't really make a connection, know that this is the right animal if someone else is buying it for you. Also, if you just buy someone an animal, they might not necessarily want it or be prepared for it or want to be committed to it. So like for example, I'm actively looking for a milk steak right now. I've been actively looking for one for months. I have not found the exact one that I want yet or for a price that I'm willing to pay and I want it to be a rescue or rehomed. So I'm just waiting and out waiting for the right one. If my parents were to find one and bought it for me for Christmas, you know, I think that would be okay because I've been actively looking for months and haven't been able to find one. So that's different from them just out of the blue buying me, say, a bearded dragon. I'm not looking for a bearded dragon right now. I don't really have a place for a bearded dragon right now. You know, maybe down the road I'd want a bearded dragon, but not really right now. So your best bet would be to stay away from buying animals. You really want to buy someone an animal for Christmas or help them buy an animal for Christmas, like I said at the beginning, money would be a great gift. They can turn around and use that to buy said animal. Well, that is my list. 
I hope this helps you guys shop for someone this Christmas or gives you ideas for your Christmas list. If you have any other suggestions for reptile keepers for Christmas, leave them in the comments below. And thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Don't forget to subscribe, like this video, and hit that notification bell so you don't miss the rest of the videos from Zoomus. We'll see you next time. Thank you.